and word of an arrest in the murder of beloved local car dealer Jose Arredondo. The announcement coming just as a celebration of life service for Arredondo wrapped up this evening in southwest Bakersfield. 17 Amber Frias has been following the developments and she joins us now with more. Amber. Jose Arredondo's sister Laura told me after tonight's service that the person arrested is a good friend of Jose's. Tonight, Mexican police confirming a man named Roberto was arrested in Mexico, two weeks after Arredondo was murdered. Mexican authorities have arrested this man, 50-year-old Roberto from Hidalgo, Mexico, in connection with Jose Arredondo's death. Due to legal reasons, Mexican authorities are not allowed to release the suspect's last name. But family members say they're well aware of who this man is. That particular person was a friend of his for 20 years. According to police and the family, he wasn't the only one involved. They have one, one of them, uh, but it wasn't just one. Uh, it was more than one, but at least they have one. And I know that that person, it's going to... It's going to talk. In a news release, police state Roberto and the company of others arrived at Arredondo's condo in Cabo San Lucas on Monday, July 15th, and beat him to death. He was not a fighter. He will see somebody argue and he will walk away. He was not a fighter. And for somebody to do that to him, it doesn't have a name. Arredondo was found dead the following day. It has just been incredibly hard. For my whole family. Last week, Arredondo's family held funeral services for their loved one. Monday, on what would have been his 61st birthday, family and friends so celebrated his says, life. If you die and you have five friends at your funeral, you're the richest man in the world. And there's many more here. Mourners offered prayers and memories during the service at New Life Church in Southwest Bakersfield. And this guy calls me on the phone and he says, hey man. I don't know if you guys remember that, but hey man, you want to play golf? A slideshow of a smiling Arredondo and heartfelt melodies. His son Samuel Arredondo also offered some words. I just want to say I really loved him so much and he really reached out a lot and he gave the community service a lot of help. So I hope one day I could be the man like him. Arredondo leaves behind his wife Laura, daughter Maria Elena and son Samuel Arredondo. We will continue to keep you updated as more information becomes available in the investigation into Jose Arredondo's murder. Amber Frias, 17 News.